Assistant! We had to make some cuts in 2020 so the assistant got fired. Oh my god, it is so weird to see myself on a camera. Hi guys! It's Julia. Welcome back to my YouTube channel or welcome if you are new. Oh my god. So like it has been like a hot minute since we've talked like guys come on. So a lot of you guys have wondered Julia where have you been? You've been gone like completely blank on all social media for like six months. Where have you been? That is what we are here to talk about today. Yes, I'm wearing a shirt. First of all, one thing that I would like to clarify, if you have seen my TikTok, I made a video about how I got a boob job. And I say it like this, because fake, fake, mosquito bite, pancakes, living my best life, guys. Fake, 100% fake. That's one thing that I wanted to clarify real quick for you all. First of all, that's another thing. My hair has grown out so much. Like This is what I looked like last time you guys saw me. She was on my name. Girl, scary. Can we talk about the big thing? Well, small thing. I'm 16 now. Crazy, oh my god, what adult coming through, move aside, people. Like, yesterday was my birthday. Today's August 5th. My birthday's August 4th. Like, 16, hello, mature adult coming through. Thank you. Like, girl. What? crazy shook up uh-uh oh beautiful nails all real baby what my nails grow like wildfire <laughs> we have a few other things to talk about but first the big thing where i've been how do i want to word this i have been living in a therapeutic treatment facility i wanted to share i had all these plans of how i'm going to sugarcoat it but no, I'm done being embarrassed of my mental health. I have a lot of severe anxiety, like a lot of depression. I've had depression and anxiety since I was like six. And so I'm here, I've been living where we are right now, I'm living in Quincy, Illinois. It's like an hour-ish outside of Springfield at this place called Chaddock and a cottage full of like, right now there is usually 11 of us but we had two girls recently leave, and so now we're down to nine. So it's me and eight other girls, which, which is where my boyfriend is. Yes, I have a boyfriend. We'll talk about that later. So one, I had this girl throw, throw a chair at me the other day. This place is crazy, okay? Like, I had a girl throw a chair at me the other day. So she was, obviously I can't say her name. For the sake of the story, we're going to call her Pepper. Pepper. Her name. For the sake of the story, we're calling her Pepper, not her real name, but that's what we're going to call her. So, Pepper was real, real mad at me one day. And, like, her and I had been kind of, like, going at it, like, all day. This was on a Sunday. And she got so pissed off at me at bedtime. And everyone else was ordered to go into their rooms. And she, like, was like, bitch, you better go back into your fucking room before I beat you up. And I was like, you know what, girl, go ahead. I'm not scared of you. And she was like, oh, girl, you about to be. I was like, uh-uh, Pepper, no. And so she charged at me and tried to hit me. Staff pulled her back. She grabbed a chair, chucked it at me and this other staff. Um, luckily, I want to give a big shout out to this staff. Can't say her name, but you know who you are, person who blocked me from the chair. Thank you so much for doing that because the chair did hit the staff. It didn't hit me. And I felt so bad. I was like, oh, my God, no, that was intended for me and you got hit. Like, so thank you so much for the staff. I was joking with that one specific staff about how, and she was like, oh, I told her, I was like, oh, I'm gonna make a video about where I've been. And she's like, oh, I bet you're gonna say, oh, there's this one staff that called me ugly. Uh, for the record, she didn't call me ugly. She did say that, she did say that I looked ugly with one of my wigs on, but she didn't say that I'm ugly. She said like, you don't have to be, see, now see if you wear your regular hair, you don't have to be, have that ugly wig on. But yeah, so for the record, thanks, love y'all staff you're the best <laughs> um but and so she and then I just like ran out the 
building. I was like, done with you, goodbye. Oh, I did go to church the other day with Pepper and this guy asked me out at church and Pepper was laughing the whole time. She was like, God, this thing only happens in movies. He walked in and he kind of like looked at me and I saw him looking at me. He was like, just like, so. And then just like was making googly eyes at me the whole time. And then at the end of the service, he, we were about to leave and he said like, hey, you want to go to Starbucks with me sometime? And Pepper was like, nope, she's busy and just pushed me out the door. <laughs> and then Pepper and I were just laughing about it like the entire time afterwards. We were driving, we were listening to music and Miss Raven's like, does anyone have sunglasses? And I had one pair of sunglasses, which, sunglasses, which I'm gonna go grab because it's funny. So I had these cute little heart-shaped sunglasses I got from my mom for Valentine's Day. And Miss Raven when asked, he's like, oh, can I borrow them? And I was, she, she I said, yeah, I've, I got some glasses. She's like, yeah, can I borrow them? And I handed her these. I was like, are you seriously, you want me to wear these? I was like, yeah, wear them. And she was literally wearing these, screaming Justin Bieber's baby at the top of her lungs in the car, and it was hysterical. I took a video, but she deleted it, so sadness. Another thing that I wanted to say is, one, I mentioned when I was talking about the different cottages, my boyfriend. Yes, I have a boyfriend. Um, I love him so much. I can't say his name, which annoys me. For the sake of this story, we're gonna call him James. It's not his real name, but for the sake of the story, we're calling him James. So James is the best. I love him so much. And I have, this is one of my absolute favorite photos in the entire universe. It's me and my stuffed animal, John, at prom. <laughs> because I got to go with, um, that's the cottage behind me. I got to go with, um, well, that's me after I got my makeup done by one of my favorite staff. Um, because my boyfriend, he's gonna be a senior this year, but when we went, he was a junior, so I got to go to his junior prom with him. But it's me and John. This is my elephant John, <laughs> so cute. Any other photos that don't have people in them? Like, I need a photo that's, like, just me. Oh, I can show this one. But, so, I look really ugly in this photo. But, I, me, Miss Raven, and this other staff have matching shirts. And so, here, I'm going to cover her face up. But, but, that's me, and that's Miss Raven. But, we all have matching shirts, and I thought that was so cute. <laughs> oh, here's me as Little Pound Cake. That's fun. They can imitate you, but they can't duplicate you. Cause you got something special that makes me wanna taste you. I want it all day long. I'm addicted like it's wrong. I want it all day long. I'm addicted like. No matter where you go.